If we want to add a sunlight to a scene, we can do that in a couple of different ways. And one of them is by using a particular kind of light object, which is a directional light uh, that represents the kind of light ray distribution that normally comes from the sun, roughly parallel light rays. And to do that, we'll go to the visualization tool set and then hit light or select the light tool. And we can see here on the upper left side that the default mode is directional light mode and also the default direction is the default direction mode. Now we can go to the preferences and open the light preferences dialog and change a couple of items here but for this exercise we will just leave it as it is and now we'll simply click on the scene and a light is placed in the scene and it's casting shadows and we can see that the light has a particular direction and altitude or height. Let me deselect this light. Now we can alter the settings for this light by going to the visualization palette and then right clicking on the light object and selecting edit. And the properties dialog box opens and we can alter some of the settings here that are set with sliders and we can see the impact uh, as we are doing it. So we can move the azimuth slider and we can move the elevation slider and we can also adjust the brightness of the light object itself. Another way to add a directional light to a scene is by going to the set sun position command which is available in the fundamentals workspace. If you're using one of the industry series you may want to add it to your workspace. So we'll go to view set sun position and now the Set Sun Position dialog opens and asks us to input a variety of information. It's pretty self-explanatory. So in this case, let's change the month from January to, let's say, April, and the day to the 15th of April, and we'll change the time to 1 p.m. And click OK. And now a directional light is placed in the scene that represents the azimuth and the elevation for the sun for that location at that time of day, that day of the year. Now there is another way of placing a sunlight in a scene and that is by using a tool called a heliodon which is available as a tool in the industry series although not in fundamentals. And that tool will be described in the next chapter.